Welcome to Ecoholics. In this lecture, we will understand important books to read for Indian Economic Service examination. So in the last lecture, we were discussing about the General Economics first paper. Now in this video, we'll discuss about General Economics 2. Now General Economics second paper, that is consists of eight parts. So for that eight parts, you have to read certain books that we now will discuss. So here I'm writing General Economics part two. So that is General Economics paper two of Indian Economic Services. Now it is having eight parts. So I'll start with the first one. First one is about economic thought. Now economic thought obviously plays an important role in order to understand economic theories of the modern time. So economic thought is an important uh, area where you get question every year, one or two question you can expect every year. So R. R. Paul is the book that you can actually read for economic thought and it's a decent book you will find a lot of points in order to write the answers in the examination. The second is the concepts of national income and social accounting so this is the second topic under general economics paper 2 uh, that is national income and social accounting for that you can refer to 12th class ncert or any macroeconomic book so any macroeconomics book you can refer for this particular topic because this topic generally asks about different methodologies to calculate GDP and social accounting national income etc and there are certain topics like green uh, green GDP etc sustainable GDP that you can correlate with your economic growth and development book now for the third one that is theory of employment output inflation money and finance for this the best book is Don Bush and Fisher so Don Bush and Fisher you can uh, take for this book uh, for this particular topic in this general economics tour and this particular book will also helpful for the second head the fourth one we are having is the money and sorry financial and capital market so financial and capital markets for financial and capital market the best book is L M Bhole so the best book is L M Bhole so you can see that particular book a uh, very comprehensive book very helpful in understanding the concepts of financial and capital market although a very bulky book but you can take certain points and certain topics that are mentioned in the syllabus for that now the fifth here is so again i'm segregating this thing now for the fifth that is economic growth and development for economic growth and development, the best book is A.P. Thrillwall. Although few people are suggesting Todaro as well, but I read Todaro. A uh, lot of, we can say, useless things for our perspective. I'm not saying that this particular book is bad, but we have to think from the exam point of view. And for the exam point of view, A.P. Thrillwall is best book in order to qualify this exam. The sixth we have is international economics and for international economics there's only one book that's the best book known as Dominic Salvatore this book considered as the Bible for international economics that you have to read if you do not have this book you can take a PDF from me as well so you can just ping me on whatsapp my whatsapp number given in the description of this video and if you are able to not find these books you can find on the online as well as offline shops and if you are not able to find any topic among these so you can also ask me on whatsapp now here the international economics dominic salvatore the seventh one we have is balance of payment so balance of payment generally actually they have defined the syllabus of international economy so again the same book will work here also 
Dominic Salvatore. And the eighth one is global institutions. Like global institutions like we have World Bank, IMF, WTO, etc. Other UN bodies related to economics. So the best thing is internet is the best source. So internet, it means the official websites of World Bank, official websites of IMF, etc. You can refer this particular topic from these websites. Do not refer from any unauthenticated sources. So if you're not able to find any of the topic, you just send me a WhatsApp message. I'll give you that. So I hope you like this video. Please like, share and subscribe Ecoholics as well as this video. If you have any doubt, if you read any other book, you can do mention in the comment box. And if you read any of the substitute books, that is also okay. So if you read, suppose, for example, Richard Freon for macroeconomics, then no need to refer for Don Bush and Fisher. Just make Richard Freon as your base book and Don Bush and Fisher for the reference book. So these are the books. These are obviously uh, not a very exhaustive list, but you can find these books very, very useful. No need to read cover to cover. Just uh, pick out the topics mentioned in the syllabus and read from these particular books. So please like, share and subscribe Ecoholics and click on the bell icon so you'll get the notification of the latest video. And apart from this, we are having our uh, course of Indian Economic Services on our mobile app of Ecoholics. For that, you can visit ecoholics.in for registration. Apart from this, we are also having other courses for UGC Net uh, Economics Optional, Econometrics, Mathematical Economics, separately dedicated courses. And if you have not seen the previous video of General Economics Paper 1 books, you can see that particular video in our playlist section. So thank you so much. Have a nice day.